Hi guys, welcome to Office Blokes React. I'm Office Bloke Dave. I'm Office Bloke Mike. I'm Office Bloke Daz. Back to the really Office Bloke. Yep. Now, Office Bloke Daz watched a comedy special the other day. So uh, last night. Was yeah, it? last night. So we'll get that out of the way that you've seen this. I have. And you started telling us, and I said, "Are the clips?" Because I'd absolutely love to see it. Yeah. Yeah. Ray Romano, I knew he was a stand-up comic, but I've never seen anything that he's ever done. Just a bit of context Same behind anything. this as well, to give you an idea. This is where he started stand-up comedy. It's in the Comedy Cellar in New York. All right. Uh, <laughs> right okay. In Manhattan. And what he's done is, um, he's two very close together. And what he's done he, he, as part of his special, he, he performed at both. All right. And then he walked, when he finished one set, he walked to the other one. Sort of thing, and then perform the second set, the, yeah. the second one, sort yeah. of thing. Oh, so right. it's it pretty good. Well, correct me yeah. to do it. Yeah. I actually heard him tell a joke the other day, and it wasn't a comedy special. It was um, I was watching somebody feed Phil. Oh yeah, and you know he video calls people mm. at the end of the episode. He video calls Ray Romano, mm. and then he gets everyone to tell a joke over the video chat. It, mm -hmm. it was it was good, <laughs> but also um, what's his face that we were talking about yesterday, uh, Robert? Yeah, he was on it. Greg Garrett. And then what I thought was his daughter mm. popped the face in, and I was like, "Whoa!" <laughs> this is why. Wow, fair play to him. Uh, so Ray Romano's best advice for getting older: check the volume before you press play. That's my best advice. <laughs> All right, good to come back, see my friends. Here's the thing about friends: when you have a TV show. And you will. We all get one. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, folks. I didn't even know who he was until he spoke them. Really? I didn't recognise him with his beard. I didn't rec on the sign view there with his beard. I didn't recognise him. Really? Yeah. I don't it's know why. Looking, not even from the uh, the title. Ray Romano. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought I knew the name, but I thought, who is there? I looked at him. I thought, I can't remember seeing him. That's the guy from the pizza place. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as he started speaking, I mean, obviously, you could oh, tell wow. him it was a mile off, can't you? Yeah. But he's got oh, a, Kermit the Frog, very yeah, distinctive. Yeah, oh, yeah, very yeah. distinctive. Yeah. yeah. It's like jury duty. You're going to get a show. <laughs> but you're going to have friends, man. You're going to have a lot of friends. And it's all right. It's a good problem, but I don't have time for my own friends. But here's what I've learned. <laughs> I'm older now. I'm, o I'm over 50. Here's what I've learned about life now that I'm older, over 50. I'll make the time to be your friend if you're a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> That's no bullshit. I want to... Who's a doctor? There's doctors here. Law of averages. What, what are you? What kind? Uh, I don't know what that is, but we're going golfing. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds good. You know shit. You know shit. Stock up on doctor friends. I'm telling you. Get his card, because you're going to need him. You get to a certain age. Every day something happens. Every day. The other day, I woke up with a sprained ankle. What happened? <laughs> no, but what happened? I went to bed, I was fine. I was fine when I got in bed. What is happening? I'm not gay, but if a gay doctor ever made a move on me, I don't know, man. I swear to God, <laughs> I don't know. That's where I'm at. That is where I'm at. I'm telling you the truth. If he has an MRI, I'm sleeping over his house. <laughs> you get older. As you get older, you need different friends. Like when you're a teenager, the one friend you need is the first kid who has a car. You got to buddy up to that kid, right? Yeah. And then you hit your 20s, new kid now. Usually a sketchy kid. He can get, yeah, he can get shit. You don't know how he gets stuff. <laughs> you don't ask. All you know is all of a sudden he can get you tickets to REO Speedwagon. Yeah, you don't know what I'm talking about. This table knows. That table knows. Yes, I'm sorry. I meant Coachella. Coachella tickets. I'm sorry. <laughs> and then 30s. 30s and 40s. New friend. Lawyer. You have to lawyer up now. Yes. Find a good lawyer because that's when it all happens. That's, you get a divorce. I'm feeling this one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 it's all falling into yeah, place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. <laughs> Incidentally, yeah. I do have a lawyer friend, but didn't call upon his services whatsoever. No, did you not? He lives a couple of hundred miles away. Yeah, yeah. Oh, right. But uh, good for the occasional beer to yeah. hear his ear off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not professional yeah. services. Good lawyer, because that's when it all happens. That's, you get a divorce. You, you gotta, you gotta get a picture of your dick off the internet all of a sudden. What happened? All of a sudden, I hit a button. 
I hit the button. <laughs> you need a lawyer. And then 50s to 70s, man. Doctors, doctors. And then here's the weird thing. In your 80s, back to the kid with the car. Yeah, full circle. <laughs> full circle. <laughs> now you need soup. Every day you need soup. Yeah. <laughs> that was great. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Especially that. really good. Yeah, it's good that I like that, like your style. Well, I'm hoping it's... there's more clips and things. I, I won't watch the special just yeah. yet, just in case. Yeah. yeah. Like I say, I've seen it. I watched it last night, so it was uh, it was fresh in my mind, but it's funny. Yeah. It's, uh, it's funny. It's, it's, it's relatable it's, again. He's a wholesome guy yeah. for me, Ray Romano. He's just yeah. like he's like someone you could just like you know, just chat with and about, yeah. about anything. Absolutely. He, yeah. he seems very, very down to earth, mm. doesn't he? And I'm guessing he's mega rich because mm. of everybody yeah, loves Raymond will money. Yeah, will. Like yeah, he, he yeah. will but he just seems like a guy. Mm. He? it just seemed down to earth, doesn't it? It just yeah. seemed like re relatable. Yeah. That's just when you mates down the pub. Especially goes into it about his um, about his missus and all that sort of thing. Another you know, marriage, yeah, how, how it, yeah, you know, sort of thing. That's, that's quite relatable and funny as well. Yeah, so it's uh, you'd enjoy it. Yeah. Obviously, when I saw uh, Brad Garrett's, Garrett's. Uh, wife, I had to Google you got Ray Boner. <laughs> <laughs> I had to Google Ray Romano's wife as well just to yeah. see if he's yeah, yeah. gone a lot younger. Yeah. And he's been married for, been married for thirty-seven years. years yeah, I think. Really? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's got like four kids as well, and he's got quite. Yeah. A bunch of, he's got a bunch of kids. No, so, it's fair yeah. play to him. him. I suppose as well because we've seen him on TV so much, he kind of feels like a friend. Yeah, yeah, already, yeah. don't he? Because we're just familiar with his character, which was mm. based on his yeah. life anyway. He's one of those guys where you say, "Been married thirty-seven years, four kids." He does seem that type of guy that mm. would be like that. Yeah, absolutely. He, he yeah. Like, fits the profile, doesn't he? Mm. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. 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 the Disheveled yeah. beard yeah. looks a bit. Broken. Normal. <laughs> yeah. Downtrodden. Yeah. 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 Beat up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it's good though, right? Enjoy Great. it. Yeah, yeah really. I enjoyed Hope that. you guys yeah. enjoyed it too. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll catch you on the next Cheers, one. Cheers, guys.